As Bitcoin continues to increase in price, there are still people that will say, well, Bitcoin is too expensive for me. I don't have $100,000 laying around. So today, let's clarify Bitcoin divisibility using simple terms. So Bitcoin is highly divisible in a similar way that the dollar is divisible. So we have $1 that is divisible into pennies. So you can have one full dollar, you can have a tenth of a dollar, or you can have one hundredth of a dollar, of course. Bitcoin is highly divisible. So one Bitcoin equals 100 million Satoshis or sats. So if we look at this visually, one Bitcoin with eight zeros behind it and a Satoshi has seven zeros with a one. So a Satoshi is the smallest atomic unit of Bitcoin. We can kind of think of it like gigabytes. So you don't have to have one full gigabyte to have a bit of information. And you can build those small bits to add up to one full gigabyte, and you can add up those gigabytes to add up to a full terabyte. Since Bitcoin is monetary information, its currency is highly divisible into tiny little bits called Satoshis. So you can have one full Bitcoin, or you can have one Satoshi or anywhere in between. You can have a million Satoshis, you can have a thousand Satoshis. In fact, $1 today equals about 935 Satoshis. Due to Bitcoin's high divisibility, Bitcoin is accessible to anyone regardless of its dollar price. And that's Bitcoin divisibility, put simply.